Today I'm going to tell you a story about how every time I go to the supermarket someone takes what I buy. I know you're not going to believe me, but I have to walk a long way to get to your supermarket just for someone to take what I bought. I just bought a wonderful refreshing can of soda. Well it's mine now. I really was thirsty thank you. Aren't you the same one who took my rice cake? You also took that one mad soda. He made me stop crying. Why do you take stuff? He made you stop crying what do you mean by that? He ran away from you. That's not the point why do you always take our stuff? I can't even purchase anything. I'm getting in a complaint to the store. I can't believe that I just bought a wonderful new cell phone. It is so high tech compared to my one with Yankna. Thank you so much I really needed a new cell phone. I guess you'll have to use your old cell phone will the antennae. I thought only the blonde one always takes my stuff. I didn't know you would too. I paid $100 for that. And I'm not the only one that they take stuff from. This has became a big problem in your store. I just bought a new book at this store. Maybe this store was cooler than I though. Cooler than I though? What's that supposed to mean? I bought this cool new thing that looks like a baseball bat. Well that bat is mine now. I am sure I can put it to good use. Also the book that you are reading is mine now. It looks really good. Thank you so much. Why are you crying so much did that baseball bat mean a lot to you? They just took our items. That's nothing to cry about. I can cry if I want to. Why are you scratching your head do you have hair lice? Okay well that's not very important about the hair lice, but still I wish you would do something about these two girls. They are jeopardizing your business. Costumers might not come to your store because of these tips. Thank you for listening to my complaint. I really don't care.